breaking news here, folks. So, is that your, is that your, is that where you're living? We're in that black truck right over here. With the two dogs. So, that, that's your vehicle. Is it registered to you? It's your mother's. What's your mother's name? Sharon Albright. Albright. So, he's CHT. So what's your so uh, what's your what's your name? Diana. Diana. And and your what's your last name? What's your date of birth, Diana? Five sixteen. I'm just asking a general question. Yeah. Alright, but understand this. Right now you're residing in an illegal structure on, on, yeah. on public lands. Just let me just let me have my second, okay? Just be honest with me if you give me any information. Okay. It'll it, okay. it's in your best interest okay. to be truthful with me. Um, what's that? Um this is the this is the gentleman that's reporting because all this is public land and it's illegal for all this garbage, uh, the jumping. Just, have the structures I, even to even see, I, I'm just saying, no. and that's fine and that's fine Diana and all I'm doing is just trying to understand what's going on out here yeah. so he's just he's the one that just told me about all this and so he's just um, he's just documenting it because he's had some issues with people actually coming out and looking yeah, at this stuff that no that's fine so what's your correct date of birth for you? Um, okay. and uh, what's your middle name right Have a valid license or an identification card in the state of Nevada? Okay, so do you have a license in Oregon? So do you have a valid license in Oregon? Okay. And what's your what uh, what's your address in Oregon? In Umatilla? This guy. Did you still get mail there? Honor, I wish Fernley Law Enforcement was like this guy. He conducts himself really well. I, I mean, it, this guy, he, uh, he's what law enforcement should uh, uphold themselves to. I mean, it, this guy is uh, really cordial, polite. I like this guy. The, Hope me and him have a good relationship. He's, he's been the only one to help me out, come out here and report on any of this. So here we are, folks. I've tried to get Channel News 11 out here. Um, I don't know. Maybe they're still talking about it. Maybe after this incident, we'll get something done. I mean, anyway. Uh, Breaking news here at Fernley, Nevada, water treatment plant. Hey, 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 Paul's on it. This guy, he's a law enforcement officer. I believe he's quite possibly a ex-military himself. So, you know, this guy knows what life's all about. You know, he served his country, and he still is. He's doing his duty like most people should. So, or most law enforcement and city people. I got your back, But you're Paul. saying, you're saying there's nobody else in there? No, there's nobody else here. And I just want to make sure that while we're out here talking, that there's nobody else in here and I don't have any, and no one's going to jump out on me. No. All right. That, that's, all I'm, that's, all I'm, that's all I'm curious about. I'm not trying to do anything wrong. No, you're not. And, and Diana, a big part of my job. 
So, Diane, I understand this. A big part of my job is, uh, believe it or not, even though I'm a law enforcement officer, is education. Okay? And so, it's illegal to, to it, for people, and I'm not saying you, it's illegal for people that dump uh, litter, household waste, um, you know, bodily waste, things like that on public land. Yep. So, the gentleman that's living here, is that the gentleman that's down there on the corner? I don't know. What's his name? It's Jeff. Okay. So, okay. Um, but just so like I was saying, education's a big part of my job. And now, you know, I've educated you that it's illegal to dump on public lands. Just like in your new Matilla, you can't go dump stuff in the forest. Yeah. Same thing in the desert. Yeah. Well, you did a good job. It looks, it, it looks good from what I saw. He hasn't seen nothing yet. I'll be taking down here. Yeah. So is Roy still living in that trailer with I that gal? I, I just see Roy. And he was chasing me for ten dollars um, one day. He gave me five the next day. And he was telling me he gave me money yesterday. And I ran all over the place. Oh my God! And, and I just and you know just kept trying okay, to. So just understand this, I'm just going to give you some basic education, alright? The, the section where your truck is parked and where that pop-up trailer is parked is private property. So I can't speak for the private property because I'm a federal officer. But as far as the lands go where we're standing right now, this trailer, based on like what I'm seeing as far as my maps and my GPS, this is BLM lands. Um, a person can legally camp on BLM lands, but they're only allowed 14 days at a time. Right, yeah, that's the same okay. Just like national forests, like all over the United States. 25 mile radius. Yep. Outside of a 25 mile radius. So you have to, so for here you'd have to go a pretty good distance. Okay. Well, I'm gonna, it's okay, Diane. So I'm gonna have a conversation with Jeff, um, but understand that, you know, the issues that I'm having here, just there's a lot of human waste. A lot of human waste, there's a lot of garbage. And, you know, people come out here and they walk their dogs. There's also some other... Like, I really don't happen. believe she's qualified to so, clean it up, actually. But okay. All right. we'll watch my step here. Yeah. You're being... You're being re I really appreciate you talking with me. Well, no, okay, I got Diana, enough of this. You guys can pretty much see what's that's going that's on here. Right? Right this guy... This guy's a good guy, man. I like him. 